Good morning. It's Friday 17th of December 2021 and you join us in Glenlochy. We're up to hopefully do a couple of Monroes, Ben Aclave and Ben Louis. We're walking in from the west side so going to get across uh, the river and see how things go for there. Uh, it's a bit claggy at the minute so we'll see how the day develops. The first part of this walk is uh, getting across the river. It's always uh, the starter that can bring a walk to a short end, but the river's not looking too bad, so we're well covered up. So we'll get across here and uh, hit the path from there on the other side. We're making for this underpass. You see the underpass at the railway? I'll let you get underneath there. The trick is just to keep walking. Don't stop. That's just looking back at the car park. It goes without saying, uh, during heavy rain or in speed, you're not going to get across these burns that we've just come through. But then again, you'd never get across the main river either, so you may never see them, but a lack of rain through this week, that was really part of the decision to come here. Now you come onto the main track, the forest, and you just go left and then you're then looking for you've got about three four hundred meters and you cross the bridge and you just cut up right up through the trees got a wee sweaty rise now up through the fire break is up through the trees. That section up from the bridge is pretty pretty boggy. I don't think you get much worse than that. Can't avoid it much either, you've got to go. You've got a blue sky up there, might be lucky yet. That's us getting up to the clag line. We're still hopefully walking through this, we might just be lucky. Some of the cloud movements just gives you that impression. Oh, that's us up at the coal. Pretty straightforward, just nice path up. A bit steep in winter. So I'm just going to head out to the first Monroe, the smaller one. It's 715 metres to go. You see we've got the sun just poking through. And not just quite high enough, so maybe get it on the second one, it's a bit higher. Well done. Very good. I'm just a wee bit shy in height, so we're going to head for Ben Louis. Hopefully we'll get through the cloud then, we'll see. That wee bit of height just made all the difference. It's been really clear. Mm. 
You can see the shark fin sticking up here. I'm not quite sure just yet what the hell that is. Kind of booty maybe. And you can see a first man row just here. The absolutely stunning day. We had a little wind. That's Ben Louis. That's looking across to Ben Offs, Ben Duffy. And you've got Ben Moore and Stabinion behind them. It's a northern quarry, Ben Louis. It's a classic winter ascent. See a bit of a broken spectre just at the shadow here. And in the far distance you can see the Ben. And in front of that it's the Buco. The Buco Ridge. The Veer Pear sticking out here. And then we're starting to struggle to identify them. Hmm? Still think that's Ben of Bury, is it not? We'd see more if it was Krugan. It's difficult when you don't see too much of the peak. Austin Ducre are normally done along with Ben Louis. That's Mike just looking down the northern quarry and uh, normally come up there in the winter. That's uh, quite a, a mountain experience. the west stop and loot. We're just gonna head down the shoulder, head down this way and pick up the gate at the at the forest again. And that's just looking down the shoulder to go back out uh, to hit the track that takes you down the eye, same as the other shoulder here. It comes up to the peak. It's a bonny mountain, it really is. Not so much in show to the south. This is a shoulder we'll go back down. We just keep uh, going left and it drops you back into the quarry. It's just a grassy slope runs down towards the forest, so nice wee loop. This is just about back into the clag. So we're just turning out the quarry, so should get through it quite quickly, I would think. No sun, unfortunately, after that. Oh, we've got a fog bow now, that's good. That just ticks all the boxes for today. 
actually warmer on the top than it is at the car. Don't get that very often. That's just looking back into the quarry, so make our way down to the gate, to enter the forest again. Quite an impressive quarry that, you certainly steep enough to avoid. This is out of the, the quagmire section. Chance to get the waterproofs and boots washed off. That says just about back at the car. So, really good, dry feet, nice and clean after the river crossing. So, that's a four and three quarter hour day, 11 and a half kilometres. So, terrific, really great. The views were getting through the cloud was just magic. So, many thanks for watching, and we'll catch you on the next one. Bye.